I'm Tony, and together with uh, Danny and Jeanette and Kyra, we hope over the next few minutes to be able to tell you something about the wonder and the amazement and the joy that we find in Youth Café. Maybe to begin by answering the first of those questions, what is Youth Café? Well, Youth Café isn't a thing. Youth Café isn't a place. Youth Café is about the people who come to Youth Café. That group of people would gather together on a Friday evening to chill out, to have fun together, to eat together, to find out more about the big questions of life and to pray together. So it's about everyone who comes and we hope that it's about you because we would like now to make a really warm invitation to you to come and join us at Youth Café. Let's hear what Danny has to say about Youth Café. Hello, I'm Danny, and I've been going to Youth Café since I was in year nine. So that's eight years, I think. But I loved it so much that I didn't want to leave. So now Kyra and I help out with Tony and Jeanette. And the first thing we do at Youth Café is we sit and we pray. And then after that, we go straight into the games that are led by myself and Kyra. And we usually play Monkey Ball, Curly Mo and Larry, um, the Evolution game cat and mouse, um, chair football, spoons and lots more games. Um, after games Tony usually um, shares the story from the Bible with us on our theme for the week so that could be from Sunday's Gospel or that could be a theme that we've come up with but our recent one was God's love for us um, and then we'll go into groups and we talk about it all together so year sevens and eights which is the group that I usually lead. Kyra has year nines and tens, and Jeanette has year elevens. Um, and it's a really safe space to talk about whatever you want in that group. Um, and then Tony sort of floats about in between all of us. And straight after group time, it's time for Jeanette's food. And it is incredible. Like she usually makes us pizzas, Seder meals, Passover meals. She even makes her own Chinese takeaway. Um, she does birthday cakes for all of us on our birthdays, or birthday milkshakes, birthday donuts. Um, and for my birthday, she made me a Kinder cake, which is my all-time favourite. Um, and then we've got time to eat and chill and talk together. And then after we've eaten, we usually go into time of prayer, and we have music from Rosie, and she plays her guitar, and we sing songs like Oceans. Um, the Lion and the Lamb, 10,000 Reasons, Good Good Father, and then after that, it's time to go home and wait two weeks for the next youth cafe. together, enjoying some nice food and, uh, and our friends. Um, so we, we usually have um, something a bit relevant to whatever we're doing that week, whatever we're talking about. So we've had lots of different things. We have soup in Lent, um, we've had um, snacks, um, we've had milkshakes and paninis and uh, sandwiches, all sorts of things. Summertime is usually barbecue time. Um, we have our burgers, sausages, and always toasted marshmallows outside. Um, again, it's a lovely evening. We usually spend the time outside cooking together um, and enjoying the sunshine. Uh, and it's nice to be with friends to do those things. We quite often do other cooking uh, 
um, things as well. We always make pancakes. Um, other things we have is we have our fake away evenings uh, where we have um, G JFC, which is Jeanette's fried chicken or a Chinese takeaway style food or um, we've had meals where we've sat down together. Um, we've had breakfast together as well. Um, even if it is half eight in the evening, we've had cereals and bacon rolls. All good fun. Um, I hope we see you soon for some fun food and friendship. Take care. Bye bye. <laughs>
If you want to know more, all the details are on our parish website. They're on cards in our churches across the parish. And um, ask somebody who comes to Youth Cafe. Many of you know Jeanette or Danny or Cara or even me and uh, we'll happily tell you more about it. Our contact details are there on the website and on the cards as well so the folks at home can ring us if they have any questions. Hope to see you soon. Bye-bye for now. Take care and keep praying. Always keep praying.